You know, I'm getting used to sleeping on my roof. Like, I wake up, sometimes it'll be raining, and it's like a free shower. Sleep on your roof, guys. You won't regret it. Just kidding. Don't. Don't do it. Hey, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back here in a block board. With the latest update, there's only one thing still that I haven't quite messed around with, and that is the hollow roof. And when I did that update video, I also mentioned that you could potentially make attics with it. So I decided for this episode, we would try to build a house with that new roof. I've also, yesterday, you're probably wondering where I was. Was. Um, I was delivering pizzas again. Can you tell? All right, let's see. I know I have a free plot. There it is. Free, free house with attic. Ha ha ha! LOL. Let's get started, shall we? All right. So yes, the roof that I'm talking about is this brand new holler. Hollered. Hello, Mr. Roof. Hollered. Okay, so yeah, I haven't used this yet. I feel like it's gonna be kind of difficult to make a house with this type of roof look good. I think I want to make something simple again and uh, nothing too crazy big because I'm gonna do two stories for sure still. We should make it a secret attic because yeah, that would be more exciting. But it's not really secret because you guys will know in the video. <laughs> I'm just sitting here thinking about my life choices again. Okay, let's do a rectangular house. And, you know, there's nothing wrong. What am I doing? Stop. Stop. What? Are you Stop. Get some help. I want to try something like this. Okay, I want to do a house that's kind of like this. So the thing about the mansard roof, it doesn't matter if you're like, if you have like curves in your house, especially like in the corners. So like, I don't want to make it fully rectangular then. Maybe I want to do like a... I still don't know. Okay, see, it's not fully a rectangle house. My biggest concern for this house, will it look good with this roof? Because this roof is not quite the best looking, right? So maybe I could somehow make a cute house with this roof. I told you guys. I told you. <laughs> How is- how am I gonna make a house that looks good with this roof? I love challenges, you know? I think that'll be okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Trust me. Trust me. We're gonna do something like this. These plain pillars will help. And wall trims. Don't forget, wall trims are gonna help this. Pillars will help this. Anything we will do to make this look good. Just so it doesn't look so plain. Because the biggest problem with this house right now, it just looks really plain. But we just started. So I cannot complain right now. Until later, when I feel like I said I'm done with it. Then I can complain. It looks more put together a little bit, if I say so myself. Uh, but yeah, let's take a look at the inside and be like, wow, let's look at that roof. <gasps> look how hollow it is. Yes, perfect. They need to make a hollow gable roof and they need to add roof trims because yeah, I like roof trims. I think the only roof trims will look good on would be the gable roofs, but I don't know. My golly, this is, uh, this is a bit flat. I need to add something else to this. <gasps> I have an idea. Like a slanted roof, just to give this more shape, because it's so flat right now. Like, I need to give it a bit more shape. I don't know if this is going to help in any way, but I like to explore my options here sometimes. I don't know, it just was too flat to look at, so I just wanted to add that roof there for whatever reason. Um... <laughs> Okay, we need pillars again. We need some more pillars to support these. I don't know what I'm gonna do for these sides. Ooh, maybe I could have like a... We're gonna add something here. I don't know, I'm just gonna add the plot. Add these floorings here just so I remind myself. This is the moment where you try too hard to make something different and it just ends up looking really strange. Maybe, maybe there's a house somewhere out there that looks like this, but... Ha ha ha! What was that laugh? Should I, do, should I do split leveling? I love split leveling. It's the same as the wall trims, you know? It's like, I have to do it. Everyone loves a good porch slash foundation, right? You know, just, I don't know, give it some shape. Give it, give it something. Do whatever you can, you know, to make it, make it look good. All right, let's just do windows. I don't care anymore. Wait, should we just make our layout? Okay, let's make our house layout, guys. Let's do our layout. Let's get these stairs going first, because I want to know where I'm going to go up the stairs. Then I think for the secret attic, we're going to do like a secret ladder. You know how those, like those attics, there's like a secret trap door thing, like a secret hatch. And then when you pull the hatch down, there's a ladder that pops out. I want to do something like that, but not with the hatch. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. What did I just say? Okay, I'm going to put the secret ladder to the attic there. And then if you're, you're like, wow, how's it secret, Peta? It's like right on the open. You just put like a wall here. <laughs> you put, you just put a wall. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll think more about the attic later. I'm just going to, um, I'm just going to work on my layout. I love my stepping stones. We're not using the, the rectangular ones this time. We're using like the rock rock. Okay, it's kind of cute. It's kind of cozy. We just need a bit more decorating and it'll look nice. Right now it's just really bland. I can put the bathroom in here. Okay, this is where the bathroom's going to be. I'm going to put the kitchen down here. I actually want- I need a place for the living room as well, so I'm doing something different now. Is that fine? As long as the stove and the fridge are not next to each other. Everyone will be fine with that. 
Look, see, look how better it- look how nicer it looks when it's like floored up and stuff. This is why you don't doubt yourself. As soon as you build one thing, you just keep going and eventually it will look alright. Building tips. Coming from a person who always thinks his builds look terrible, which, you know, sometimes they actually are bad. Sometimes I can make a decent build. Oh, this house is kind of cute. Oh, wow. <laughs> Scooby-Doo. There it is. Oh, see, that's like the cousin of Linden, Hurricane Gray. Okay, basically I have my kitchen, living room, bathroom done. So we're gonna work on the bedroom, secret attic, office area, maybe laundry room next. Look how, ooh. Whoa, this house layout though, ooh. I like, it's fancy. What's so secret? How do I make it secret? Yeah, I could just use a secret bookshelf. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. This is totally not suspicious. Uh, we need to cover up this um, evidence that we even have like an attic going on. So, oh my god. Okay. Or over here. Might have to make the roof a little bit higher. Wow! Wow, I'm really, I'm really like shocked. I'm like, wow, I'm doing kind of something. Someday my friend's technique once again where uh, the wall's touching are not matching, but the walls opposite are the ones that match. I think I like that. I think I like it. <laughs> this table runner, it kind of clips through the table, but honestly, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna watering can here, but we're gonna put the flowers in there and make it like very aesthetic, you know, like aesthetic lifestyle because you're quirky and you... <laughs> I'm gonna put a watering can there and put stick flowers in there. I'm gonna stick some flowers in there. You know, you just kind of find whatever you want to put on this shelf. I'm gonna put like a toy car here as well. Okay, oh, I can put it on the stairs too. Oh, <gasps> yes, I forgot you could put photo frames on stairs. All right, and then this is our secret aloft. This is our secret attic area. So let's, okay, I'm done for now working on this part of the house. I think that's good enough. We're done here. So let's work on the attic. Yes, okay. So this is gonna be the chill secret area. This is where I'm gonna relax and stuff. This is where I'm gonna hide from people. This is gonna be my panic room. <gasps> oh my god, I'm so, oh wow, I'm so excited. It's too bad I, I can't, uh, the thing is with this room, you can't turn the roof off. So you have to like, you're forced to stare. I'm gonna try to make this look nice too. If it's a secret attic, we should just like have a whole dance floor up here, honestly. I have a lot of dance floors, don't I? <gasps> I should just put all, yeah. I'm gonna put some dance floors up here. Stuff from here. Ooh, even like a jukebox. Oh my god. This is perfect. And then I want to like a... <gasps> I should put an arcade machine up here too. Play those video games. And maybe like a popcorn machine right above the mini fridge. Right? Yeah. Someone's going to notice that. <laughs> someone's going to notice that. Like, why, is that? why is there like confetti going through your ceiling? I'm going to put a hay, hay bale up here. <laughs> okay, I'm done. This is my attic. It's uh, it's all right. I think it looks pretty decent. So we'll just we'll just go with that. Last thing I need to do is color the entire um, outside of the house, and we'll be done. We'll be set finally. Or cadet blue. <gasps> oh, let's do a cadet blue. That's not like blue blue. It's like a, it's a it's a it's blue still, but you know what? it's kind of cute. It's kind of like a <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. It's very interesting. Okay, okay, it's. Wow! Whoa! Yeah, look at that. Oh, this is not dying. Is that it? Is that what I did? Is that- Are they matching? Oh my god, they are. Wait, it looks a little bit weird. Okay, we gotta just keep going. We gotta keep going, keep going, keep going. We gotta keep going, keep going, keep going. Maybe some sunflower. That's very nice. <gasps> yes, I'm done. Alrighty, guys. So I made a house that I don't normally- I think the style is not- it's a different shape, that's for sure. I think the style is very similar, but the shape is like different. So this is what, this is the house I made trying to use like the hollow roof because I didn't know how to make a nice looking house with this type of roof, but I think this ended up looking pretty decent. Of course, I made it blue, but I also used a lot of hurricane gray instead of linen. It's kind of like linen's brother or sister. Uh, anyway, let's get, let's get started. Let's go into the inside. If you go to the inside, this is how it turned out. I actually really like it. Oh my God, did I do this? Whoa. Oh, I did it. And this is how it looks. This is the living room area. And then over here, I have the kitchen. And then over here is like a microwave. So we're not missing the microwave. Don't worry. There's a blender and then there's a coffee maker there. And if you go over here, this is where the bathroom is. It's really plain, but yeah, that's the bathroom. And if we go upstairs, this will lead you to the bedroom area. And I love, love, love how this looks. And then over here, we got the laundry room. Also kind of plain, but I think it's more... I don't know, I like this better than the bathroom for some reason. There's a secret attic. 
Yes, it happens to be behind this bookshelf. And oh gosh, I forgot to color that, but it's okay. We'll just close this and then we go up here. Oh god. Okay, you know what? <laughs> uh, we might have a con Okay, we might have a concussion, but don't worry. Um, this is the attic. <gasps> oh my god, wait, it looks so nice. Wow, so pretty. We got our dance floor. I really didn't know what to do up here, so I just added... Okay, I wanted the office to be up here, but at the same time, there's still a lot more space to fill up, so I put a dance floor, because this is my panic room, so... Um, but yeah, that's basically it, actually, for this house. But anyway, guys, that is basically it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, you found it dumb, silly, interesting, or inspiring in some sort of way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And if you guys want to continue watching any other Roblox videos on the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It is completely free. Thank you all for taking the time out of your day to watch this. I'll talk to you in the next videos. Stay tuned. Stay awesome. Have a wonderful day. Peter Bread signing out. Goodbye, everybody.